Oh, welcome back to race day. So today we have the Monogram Tornado, which is just an interesting car. It uh, has the chassis rip-off clone type of deal of the Tamiya Hotshot. And it was marketed by Monogram, but if you look around at things on it, like right there, it says uh, 1985 Bandai. So I'm pretty sure it was made by Bandai. Ripped off from Tamiya and sold by Monogram. But uh, a lot of people call it the, the, the Hot Shot clone. I call it the Not Shot. But it's a really cool looking vehicle and it's kind of. It doesn't really drive the best, but it's just a classic and we're doing vintage races, so it had to be here. It does take four double A's in order to run the steering, so I'm hoping the steering is going to be able to do the tight turns. If not, we'll, we'll run it for what it is and do what we can with it. And other than that, and I said four, four batteries for the steering, plus your normal battery for the motor, and another six batteries in the radio. Uh, it takes quite a bit to get this guy up and going. As you can see, it's pretty clean. I don't take it out of the box very often. All right, guys, I'm about to apologize for probably the most brutal race you'll have to watch this season. It, uh, it doesn't like to turn right. It's got the speed, not the steering. And we got our old stick controllers. So I gotta kinda cut across the track a crazy way. It's not ideal. We're just hoping to get down in the, in the 13s. That'd be really cool. We got in the 13s, I'm happy. No matter what happens now, I'll keep this run. <laughs> this is good, because it's going to need it. <laughs> uh, the 13s is about the best as I could hope for out of this thing. See, it's got the, plenty of speed, but the steering is just not there. Do a slide around that turn, maybe a little... A little. We got in the 13, so I won't complain. Come on, buddy. We've got to finish the lap out. All right, the not shot is doing it. Five seconds. Race summary. Fastest lap. Lap two, 13.36 seconds. Slow lap. Lap five, 16.65 seconds. Average lap time. 19.14 seconds. <laughs> and we're stuck. <laughs> we're literally high sided. One wheel on each side is going nuts. Get off there, buddy. Alright. So, uh, we'll go to the scoreboard. I'm pretty sure I know where it's going. And, uh, you know, <laughs> unfortunately, the sticks make it. If, if we were going the other direction on the track, I think it would have been okay. It wouldn't have been ideal. But it would have been better than it was because it can turn to the turn to the left. It just don't like to go to the right. And, you know, with a little bit of, I think with a little bit of work and a hobby grade conversion, this thing would probably be a nice little buggy. I may have to do that one day. Scoreboard time. And back to the scoreboard. Here we are with our two wheel drive and four wheel drive categories. Let's see where this tornado ends up. Well, that's good. At least I don't need to move anything. Oh, it is slower than the nitro burner. We'll put that right down there. But, you know, somebody's got to be last, so. The, the Tornado, it's kind of, uh, it's one of those cars that if you took the time to switch it over to hobby-graded electronics, it'd probably do really nice. But just driving it as it is, that uh, stick radio they have doesn't work so good. The steering is not so great. So that's probably the majority of the problem. If you had a decent servo in there with uh, a modern ESC, that thing would probably handle great. But, well, that it is what it is right out of the box. And here we are. Oh, okay, stay tuned. Uh, we have more coming up.